So epiretinal membranes um, are something that's an abnormal condition. We, we know that in a normal individual, the internal limiting membrane lines the inner surface of the retina. And an epiretinal membrane is nothing more when that internal limiting membrane thickens and now causes tractional forces on the macula. The reality is, is that this oftentimes will subtly either distort the vision or cause a reduction in best corrected visual acuity. So what do we do when we find something like this on eye wellness? Well, if it's the first time that we're seeing these patients, what we'll oftentimes do is see them back in three months to determine whether or not the epiretinal membrane that was identified is actually changing. If it looks stable, if it looks the same, what we'll then do is we'll typically see these individuals back in six month intervals to determine again whether or not it's changing. And what we always arm them with to bring home with them is an Amsler grid to determine or so that they can actually test their vision very, very closely on a day-to-day -day basis.